Welcome to Primo, the library search engine for books, ebooks, articles, journals, e journals, dissertations, and more. This tutorial will explore the basics of searching for and accessing electronic materials through Primo V, an easy to use, powerful tool. Before searching electronic resources, let's briefly tour the Primo V interface. As you can see, we have a search bar at the top, various filters on the left, and search results in the center. For more searches on specific topics, you can use more specialized search tools, which you will find above the search bar. Journal search, database search. Let's perform a basic search. Suppose you are looking for information on wind energy. Type the keywords into the search bar and hit search. To find electronic resources, including articles, ebooks, and e journals, use the search profile Gdańsk Tech Library plus articles. The result page will display relevant materials. To narrow your search only to electronic resources, use the availability filter. You can also explore advanced search techniques using Boolean operators and, or, and not for more precise results. Now that we have search results, let's access an electronic resource. You can often access full text electronic sources from the search results with just one click to PDF or a direct link to the e resource. To simplify accessing scholarly resources, you can use the additional view issue contents feature to browse, read, view, or monitor other e resources connected with the selected journal. On the items page, you will find more details such as title, author, publication information, availability, and additional features. Sometimes access to materials may not work, and in that case, you can try to use a different web browser, pin the cache and cookies in your web browser, and check if you have the latest version of the browser. If none of this works, please give us feedback so we can investigate the cause of the error and fix it. If you have any questions or encounter difficulties, please get in touch with the library's team. Thanks for watching.